they're in a pretty untenable situation right now because you have a president who, frankly, does not trust people on his own staff. He is serious about all of the leaks that have come out since he took office. He is trying to keep information away from people on his staff. The fact that the communications staff didn't find out about this decision until an hour before it was announced, they were set up for failure in that situation by the president. If he can't trust people on his staff to implement his decisions, it's going to have ripple effects across his entire agenda, not just dealing with this Comey situation. I will say, though, the president goes through these phases where he will start asking people, who do you think would be a better chief of staff? Who do you think would be better at the podium? Often he gets and talks himself out of those decisions. So he might be in those moods right now where he's ready to clean house. By Monday morning, we could wake up and we could be talking about a completely different landscape. I want to pick up on your comment about the, the president's agenda, Josh, because as I discussed with the two senators, the president's agenda seemed to be finally gaining some momentum with House passage of repeal and replace, Senate working on that, talk about tax reform, other issues. How much concern is there in Republican ranks that the continuing furor over this, and, and more importantly, the disarray inside the White House, the impact it may have on the president's agenda, and is there concern in Republican ranks that he, about him possibly being a drag on the party in the 2018 midterms? Well, look, I think in terms of his agenda, it's the one piece that almost every Republican from, you know, in the Senate, from Susan Collins to Rand Paul, think we ought to be focused like a laser on. And as long as the, the president and his administration stays focused on it, the, all of the Republicans on Capitol Hill seem very content for that. The question is whether or not all of this distraction 